Okay, sixth grade, lesson 117. This is on finding a hole when a fraction is known. Now, this is an example. Here's what, listen to this story problem. It says that two-fifths of the runners in the race are warming up. So, two-fifths of the runners are warming up. Let me just write that down. Okay? Then it says this. How many runners are in the race? How many are in the race? Now, first thing you want to do is you want to be able to draw a picture of um, parts of a hole. So, for example, I'm just going to draw a chart that shows one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. Okay? And this is always good to use pictures because it makes it easier for your brain. Okay, so they're telling me that two-fifths are warming up, right? That's what they said. Two-fifths are the, of the runners are warming up. And then it says this. If there are ten runners warming up, so this is the people that are warming up, and there are a ten total in there. So what does each of those get? Mm -hmm. If this is ten total, what does each of this get? Uh, five. Five. So, this is five and this is five, which means that there are ten warming up. But they want to know how many are in the race. That includes all of them, not just the ones that are warming up. Well, if this one's five, then that means all of them are five. So, how many are in the total or in the race? Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. So, your answer would be 25 are in the race. You get it? Mm hmm Feel like you understand? Okay, let's try another one, all right? And we'll keep doing these kind of problems. <clears throat> Here's what it says. Three-eighths of the townspeople voted. How many voted? Okay, so again, here's what the problem says. It says three-eighths of the townspeople voted. So how many voted? Three. Three out of the eight. Very good. So if 120 of the townspeople voted, okay, so now they're giving us information. So the first thing we're going to do is draw our chart, our illustration. of the eight voted, right? Okay, so now listen. Three-eighths of the townspeople voted. If 120 people, uh, uh, 120 of the townspeople voted, so how much, how many people are in this portion? 120. 120. 120. So, what do I divide three portions to figure out how much each of you them is? You divide 120 by three. three. Exactly right. So, 120 divided by 3 is going to give us 40. Okay? So that tells me that there's 40, 40, and 40, which is 120. But the question is, if 120 of the townspeople voted, how many people live in the town? That's this whole thing. 40 times, 40 times 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, eight. 6, 7, 8. 40 times 8 gives us 320. So the answer is 320 people. All right, last problem, and we're done. Here's what it says. Six is two-thirds of what number? I'm just gonna put a number sign for number. Six is two-thirds of what number? Okay, first of all, let's go and draw our chart, three of them, one, two, three. Six is two out of the three. Six is two, so this makes a total of six. So, how much is in each of these? Um, three. Three. So, six is two-thirds of what total number? Three, six, nine. So, this whole thing's nine, but two-thirds of it is six. Final answer is nine. That is lesson 117.